I saw a property that was enticing, but it had been sitting for some time. And it was starting to cop a suntan, as I say. And I'm like, okay, what's going on with this property? It's been out there for eight months. Is it just in shambles? Is there other issues that you know about? And once we got to the heart of it, it was significantly overpriced, but more importantly, it needed work. You were going to, you couldn't just move turnkey into this. You were going to have to put a couple hundred grand in this commercial property to get it to the level that would have managed what we were looking for. To me, that was the first sign of a property that I thought I could structure subject to on because it had been sitting and we had a seller that obviously wanted to sell, but wasn't getting any type of action there. Is that another way that you would identify an opportunity for subject to? Yeah, anything different and outside the box, what you just described is one of many. Anything that's not easily bankable. Okay. Or here's some quirky ones. Like if you call someone and then they're a seller, Mm -hmm. they're selling for sale by owner and their voicemail is full, or they don't call it back, or they're rude. They're going to chase away most people. Okay. And that's a great one to follow up on. 